Hi, this is Tanya from Love Buddha Tarot, back with the monthly reading for March for Libra. Now, first of all, thank you to everybody who's been watching these videos. Thank you to the new subscribers and for all the messages I'm getting as well. Uh, it was last month was the first month I'd done them and they've proved really popular. So thank you for that. And it is really appreciated. You know, I, I, I'm loving connecting with you all and loving the fact that you are seeing the videos are resonating and that they've helped as well, because that is that is the reason um, for them. So thank you again. I'll get straight on with the cards. Now, Libra, <laughs> I would like to be nice, you know, and I will, I'll try and be as nice as I can, but lot, it, it, it's going to be a pretty bumpy month, I think, I think, Libra. Uh, very torn. This is, this is what I'm feeling, you know, it's like, which way do I go? This is it. I really feel we're at a crossroads sort of thing, Libra. Now, First of all, I feel that there's a feeling with many Libras, and I'm, I'm, I'm getting it here as I'm talking, it's like a wanting to breathe, you know, feeling like I'm being a little bit suffocated, feeling like I'm quite trapped, feeling like I write okay, you know, I, I, I need to get out, I need to... I need to get out, I don't know if you've been spending too much time in the house, if it, this is a situation or what, but it's like... Run free, <laughs> born, born free, <laughs> run free, this thing in there. What's that song with the lion, born free? Um, I cannot remember the words, but that, that, that's, that, that's what they showed me there, you know? Um, right, so yeah, this is a really, but it's feeling like you can't escape. This, this is what I'm getting, and I feel this is very evident within the beginning of the month, um, Libra. So we've got this sort of, I'm almost like as if you're, you could even have been praying because this is like I'm seeing you on your knees, like, please, please, I need, I need to change things. Um, I also feel as well, it's like there's a real, there's a real feeling here of suddenly seeing things how they really are and not how you thought they were as well, or not how you were told they were. So it's like you've been living this little like charade sort of thing for a while. And now suddenly it's like the truth is just staring you in the face. And I really feel like there's a lot of, it's like the, the, the illusions are disappearing here, but it's sort of like, I'm, I'm saying here, I want to, I'm getting here that it's like, I'm wanting to, Burn things down, if that makes sense. Burn, there's, um, yeah, you know when they, they're showing me like, I, I don't know, I got that bone free and that's like sort of Africa, isn't it? And then they show me, you know, when they completely burn the fields, you know, to, to sort of start again or to get rid of what's there or what, I don't know, but this is like, you know, and it's, it's, I even feel like burning bridges as well, you know, so it's like feeling that you need to get away, you need to cut things off completely, you know, so that you can have this freedom, um, and burning the bridges so that, you know, so that there's no going back as well, because when I'm getting this, Libra, sorry, um, this should start to flow a little bit in the minute, I'm just seeing what I'm getting here. What I'm getting is I feel like you are feeling like two different people. It's like two different sides of you. And there's a part of you that's cut off and cold and right, okay, I'm sticking my ground and I'm this. And then there's this other part. And it's like, you know, this other part is 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 wanting this excitement, wanting this spontaneity. So we're, we're getting the total two, two sides here. And I even feel that we, there's a big... This is a battle between logic and and spirituality. So we've got like, it's like the ego and the soul having a battle. Now, this has came out in, in February's readings as well, in the daily readings. And it's like, I feel this part of you is having to bite your tongue and you're not being able to talk about what you really want to talk about or these things that are be suddenly becoming aware to you because it's like you're having these little realizations all over. You know, these little like bubbles are popping and these bubbles all have knowledge in and it's like you're wanting to spill out and you're wanting to talk about what you're feeling. But there's this like sort of scientific logical side that it's like, well, no, that's not real, you know, but then it's like the spiritual side that's, yeah, this is the way the world is, the way society says it is, that is not real, you know, they're, they're bringing into me, their only love is real, 
don't know if that means anything to you, but it's like this, it's like warm versus cold, hot versus cold here, you know, so there's, I feel when you are tapping into your spirituality or stuff like that, there's this, you, you, you feeling it, you're feeling this flush, you're feeling this rush, but then when you take yourself out of it and go back into sort of logic mode, there's this coldness and and there's 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 nothing there. Um and it's like I really feel it's happiness. This this is this is what it is, is you're wanting, but it's how do you get that, you know? Um you want positivity, you want, you know, we've got cycles here. This is going into a new cycle, I feel, and I really feel you're like you're feeling this in your being and it's like you were feeling connected to source in some way and you are feeling this energy it seems to be energy there's a lot of energy around this 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 month um libra for you and it's like i don't know if you've been contemplating or looking back over the years and stuff like this because it's sort of like i feel my head's in a bit of a spin here i mean it's positive you've got the sun card here so it's like you know, but it's spinning around, and I don't know if you're realizing it's like, what is it? You know, that's an, that's another year gone or something like that. So it's sort of I'm I'm feeling this real like um this needing to move, needing to get out. This is what you know. It's it's like itching to to get away here, and yeah, we've got the fool card here. You know, so this is about wanting the freedom, wanting to take that leap, wanting wanting a playful side, wanting fun injected in your life as well. Now, there's an element of fear here. There's an element of fear of going forward. And there's an element of, of, of speaking your mind here. I mean, I, I know when, you know, a lot of people that have spoke to me and when they suddenly develop spirituality or when they suddenly start connecting to spirit or something like that, they say that they're frightened to tell people because people will think, you know, that they're either making it up or they're, you know, they're mad or something like that. So this is it. It's like, I'm getting, you know, like when a little kid comes home from school and they've learned so much and they just really want to just tell you about it. But for some reason, it's like you're having to put your hand over your mouth because it's, it's I, I don't feel it will be, I don't, I think you know it won't be understood with, with people. So it's like you're, oh, you're, it's like you're playing two different roles here and it's like switching roles, you're, you know, so you're having to change who you are in different company and in different circumstances, I feel, Libra, if that makes sense. And this is getting quite draining for you and this is causing you to feel quite off balance. Now, what I'm getting here is like everybody wanting a piece of me, everybody wanting a piece of me as well. So I really feel like people are just just there, just at you and you're just giving and giving and giving and you're totally, totally depleted. And this is like, this is leaving you completely, completely empty. So we have this battle where you've got all of this internal, like creative energy wanting to go forward, but you're giving that much to other people. And it's like, people are coming cap in hand to you. People are just wanting, people are just taking. And it's like, you're sort of, there's, I feel towards the mid month, you're going to be thinking, it's going to be a lot of worry coming around. And it's going to be thinking like, you know, are my goals out of reach? You know, is what I'm wanting for? Is it just a pipe dream? You know, I don't want you to. I don't want you to think that because what this is saying here is, you know, you know that it's not a pipe dream. You know that your dreams can be reality, you know. And yes, you may have to turn your world on its head, but this is what you're. it's needed because you need to look at your world in a different way here. I really feel some of you may... It's like you are, <clears throat> it's like you are, there's something you're trying to stop, but you're compelled to do it. You're trying to block, there's so many parts of yourself that I feel you are blocking off here. Um, and it's like <sighs> the man in the iron mask I'm getting. This, this is what they're showing me, the man in the iron mask, like locked in the tower. Um, and it's what is going to happen here is this, this, this rage of being um, encaged, right? Rage of being encaged, right? Is I feel it's 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 going to come to a point. You know, it's like no, you 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 can't do this. You know, and it's like 
I feel like you've been patient for so long, but it, it's like spirit are not going to shut up to you. Spirit are wanting you to listen to them, you know, and what they're telling you is, is yeah, you know, you can have the balance. Your dreams will and can be reality. You just need to actually get rid of these blockages because I feel that a lot of your chakras are blocked, um, Libra. There's a lot of them. We really need to do some chakra work. You can do them. There's YouTube meditations and things like that, but it's changes are needed. You need to change something because staying like this is just going to, it's, I, I really feel you're sort of at a person point, if, if that makes sense. Um, we also have um, a lot of spiritual lessons coming in here as well. So it's, it's like I say, there's Spirit are really, really talking to you this month, Libra. So pay notice to your dreams, you know, maybe even go to a development group, have a reading, something like that, because you need, you need, I, 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 it's not like you need advice, you need verification that what you are feeling and what you are thinking is right. So this is where you're going to get it. You know, I feel, I feel you don't, you're not going to get it from a textbook. You know, because this isn't science. This is, do you know what I mean? This is spiritual science. And it's it's very, very different. But I really feel as we go through this month, Libra, we're getting to a point where you are just, that's it. I've had enough. And I really feel that this is where you are just going to say, that's it, you know, and you will then head out in search of your dreams as well. Maybe scary, but it's like, you can it. You can it go on like, like, how you want to, you know, you, you, you can it, uh, how you've been going on, sorry, you can it go on like that, and the law you may be scared, the law there may be this fear, it's like you know that your life means, means more, you know, than being, like I say, this man in the iron mask, um, and then what we have here, it's, it's right, okay, I don't know if this is, yeah, I, when when I'm when I'm looking here, I'm getting um, there's. I feel there could be three people involved in this, and you are in the middle. So it's it's like I say, I, f I feel that there's choices here, um, Libra, and I feel that this is. Yeah, it's sort of you know where does your where does your happiness lie? So it's. Right, okay, so it's, it's, you've got your logic, you've got your spiritual side, right, okay, where you can, you can, um, and both of them are talking to you, right, okay, this is it, sorry, just bear with me when they're giving me stuff this, so freedom versus security, this is what we're getting, you know, and this is the choice that you have to make, you know, do you want freedom, do you want security, that is, that is, that is what is there. Now, this is interesting because I pulled an Osho card as well for the overall reading. And what we have here is the King of Clouds, and this is control. Now, I don't like this card because I don't like control. <laughs> but like I say, this is it's this man is rigid in this. You know, he's rigid. If you look at his hands, his his hands are clasped, his knuckles are white, you know, and he is like like trying to to keep himself in, you know, and this is either this is either him. You know when I was saying, like, the man in the iron mask? Can you see this? It's like he's encased in a pyramid here. And it's like it's squashing down on him. And it's, you know, this feeling of suffocation that I said I got in, in the beginning as well. And we have the light of spirit and everything around here. But it's not being able to penetrate because there's all of this, this sharp edges around. Now, I, I, I read this card the other day and I said that these look like Venetian blinds to me. And that, you know, this is quite, it's sort of trying not to see, you know, trying to keep control here. What I actually got with this today when I looked at it, which I thought was so funny, it's like sort of, I feel that it looks like there, it's like a rocket man. So it looks like he's ready to just launch out and break through these these pyramids and this encasing that he's actually in. Can you see that? Can you see what I mean? So it's like just going to go woof right over there and then it's going to go, right, it's going to go over, right, okay. They're saying to me here, um, the song, like over the rainbow, right, somewhere over the rainbow, way up high, there's a dream that I dreamed of once in a lullaby. 
yeah, so the the card fell out, yeah, somewhere over the rainbow. I don't know the full words of that. One day I'll wish upon a star and wake up where the clouds are far behind me. Yeah, right, okay, so, you know, you get the gist there. So, like I say, I feel he's ready to catapult these. He's ready to get rid of this control and just actually use this control as a way to catapult him away from, from it, if that makes sense. So, it's like... If you keep something so tightly, the second the door is open, it it is gone, you know. And I think this is what's what's going to happen. You know, you've been in cage for that long that it's just open door. You know, I said in the beginning, this is like this is like bone free. You know, what what's coming what's coming in here. And what I want to say to you is, please don't let any confusion, any confusion within your own head, any internal battles, because I think what this is. This is what's coming in here. But I want to say there's security there as well. You know, now this may mean, this may mean a little bit time of soul searching for yourself, you know. And I really feel that there's an element of, there's some healing needs doing here. There's some heartbreak that I feel it's like we need to take the knives out so that this can actually heal as well. Again, I'm, I'm thinking this could be a three-way situation, um, Libra. You know, for those of you that can relate to that, please, like I say, let me know because this is what's coming in. Um, but it's this. There needs to be communication here. This kind of go on the way it the way it is. I want to say to you as well, be very careful. I feel that there's somebody around that you can't trust. It's somebody that's holding back as well. Um, I feel that. I feel they could have a little bit of a like a goatish type beard here, and it's like they're offering their hands to you as a form of help, but it's they're keeping stuff stuff from you. So I don't feel you are being told the full story, Libra. I really, really don't. So be aware of that. You know, it will come out though. But I really feel this could be with you. You know, being at this crossroads where you, you're having to choose, which I said, and I feel this could be in connection with the move that you are going to make. I feel that's it. So be careful what people are, are saying about this because it sort of could be like somebody could be trying to put a roadblock in, in your way, you know. And what I want to say to this is... Right, okay. <laughs> Giving me loads of songs this month for you, Libra. Um, right, okay, this is a Smith song, I think. I know it's over, and I don't know the words. Please look them up. Um, I wish they would give me these at the beginning of the reading so I could actually have them there for you, but there's something, yeah, it's, it's, it's walking away, walking away from all the music again. Walking away from all the troubles in my life. I don't even know who that is. Is that Craig David or something? You know, we've had the Smiths, Craig David, Judy Collins, Jesus. You know, it's like a bit of, there's a bit of a uh, bit of a mix there going on. I don't know if that's actually um a mixtape that anybody would want to listen to, born free, over the rainbow. Um, I know it's over. The Smiths was there another one? Um and I'm walking away. Right, okay. So anyway. What I want to say to you here is it's time to put your baggage down, Libra. This is, you know, it's going to be, this month is, pff, I don't think you can expect it to be easy. I think it's going to be challenging, but I think it is going to be worth it. You know, there's a choice that needs to be made. We have the lovers here, and I do feel that this is around relationships as well. I, I really, really do. There's a beginning coming, there's a new beginning, um, and this is after the truth has been dealt as well. I spoke in, um, I think it was Virgo's reading as well, there was, there was a thing about the karmic law, and I really feel this is coming in as well. So this is about the truth, you know, no hiding from the truth now, that's it, you can't hide from the truth. Um, and this is in your hands, you know, it's like you are being given a chance to mould your life um, you may be trying not to see this because it might you might be sort of feeling pretty tired, and I feel that you don't feel powerful neither, um, Libra. There's a there's a, a feeling of your power being taken from you in some way, but I feel you're going to get this back. You know, please do some meditations on your solar plexus. 
try and wear yellow if you want. Eat bananas. I know this sounds really strange, but eat bananas. I really feel that there's potassium needed here um, for some reason. I don't know what potassium... Um, potassium gives you cramps and things like that, doesn't it? And I'm like, yeah, this is there's an uncomfortableness here, but I feel that you stepping into your power and I feel you being victorious as well by the end of the month here, Libra. And it's, yeah, we've got, you know... This is goodbye to the old and hello to the new. This is a whole new you as well, you know, where there's a lot more balance coming in. It's like it's like you're flowing, you know, we've got we've got the temperance here. And this is sort of like, you know, that that's sort of the alchemy of mixing everything together, mixing, you know, the water and the fire and, you know, and actually forming magic. If you see the bottom of there, the bottom of there. So. Like I say, it's wake up time, Libra. <laughs> Sorry about this, but you know, this is about, this is about, this is about you and this is about you making the decisions that you need to. And I feel this is about, you know, going after your heart, going after your dreams, um, leaving what is overgrown behind and actually going out in search of the future that that you want and like I say be careful you know this person with a little bit goaty I don't know who it is but they could try and block I feel there's going to be a few blocks on on the road with it but I feel you will I feel you will get there you know so like I say there's no use crying over spilt milk they're saying you know you've got your strength here and carry on with your strength I think that is what's going to what's going to help you you're going to have this battle like I say you're spiritual in your your ego side but I feel if you go with your intuition you you know what's right you know so like I say I hope you like that one Libra I'm, I'm worn out <laughs> I'm absolutely worn out reading that one um but it's it's not bad it's just like I say it's this it's this breaking free you know this is what I feel is is needed here you know um and I do feel by the end of the month, this is this is it. So it's 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 mid month. It's it's just like this this ball of fire, ball of confusion, you know, coming coming out. Um, yeah, a lot of fire around this. Real lot of fire. I don't know. This this is passion and this is anger. This is you know like burning, you know, um, burning love. They're saying there. I don't know what, who who sang that one. God. They, I'm going to stop because the, the the music's just just coming 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 through so much with with this uh, reading. But anyway, I hope that message uh, made some sense to you, Libra. Please let me know if it did. And if anybody would like a reading with me, please get in touch via Facebook or via my website. The links are below um, in the description. <coughs> I do uh, phone, I do Skype, I do email, I do Facebook Messenger readings. Uh, please be aware of the time difference, though, because I am getting a lot of people from overseas and, you know, I'm, I'm on Greenwich, Greenwich Mean Time, so I'm on UK time. Um, and please, if you like these videos, please let me know, like them, share them, subscribe. You know, it's, it, it's great. I really, really appreciate uh, all of the new people that have come on board. And I just hope this made some sense to you. Satnam.